like uh, we got here behemoth saying uh what are you drinking asmond uh, asmond gold what are you drinking bro why drink water when i can drink dr pepper i recently bought a six pack of it and i'm sipping on it right now letting it flow through my veins and giving me pure big dick energy I'm in chill, laid back mode, and let's go big dick boys to celebrate one of the greatest beverages of all time. It's all get... about sipping on Dr. Pepper and being in chill, relaxed mode. Oh my God. Okay, quiz on here so says, did you wash your hands? Let's go, let's see. Well, of course I didn't wash my hands. Uh, why would I wash my hands when I got a clean dick? I'm good to go, just how it is, boys. Although I will admit I could use a nice Dr. Pepper at this moment. That would liven up the situation nicely, but it is what it is, true and real. Asmongold, why are you uh, bald? Why am I bald? Dude, I'm not bald. I'm rocking a full head of hair over here. You think I'd be going around with this perfect widow's peak and I was bald? Honestly, I'm thankful for the perfect hairline I've got. It took me several years of oiling and product use to get it to this state. I'll tell you what, if you don't believe me, come to one of my streams and take a look. There it is, boys. True and real. Kihti123 is asking AI Asmongold, what is your favorite vegetable? Uh, dude, that's like a loaded question. I mean, I think carrots are pretty tight and I put them in a lot of meals, but I'm definitely a Dr. Pepper over water kind of guy. So that should tell you something about my veggies. That being said, I love a nice crunchy celery to dip in some ranch and shove in my maw, so that's probably my top favorite. But I mean, I also think Brussels sprouts are pretty dope because you can throw them on a pan with some butter and have them all sizzling like a steak. It is what it is, guys. It is what it is. Uh, I know it's maybe personal, but let's go. How big is your schlong? Uh, whoa, 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 easy there, bro. Such a personal question. Should I even have to answer it? I mean, that's like asking me about my Dr. Pepper drinking habits and how often I take a shower. It's too embarrassing, you know? But it's okay. I can take it. Let's just say that it's big enough that people usually don't ask me again when me and my friends go to 7-Eleven to buy beef jerky. Big dick energy, that's what they call it. It is what it is, guys. It is what it is. We said we have your Allegral saying, ask if the, like... Uh, is the Labraca da Brador good name for Worgen Mage? Dude, it's definitely a wow question, but I'm not sure if it's an Asmongold question. Uh, I'd have to say no to that one, man. It's a pretty funny name, but I'm not sure I'd give my Worgen Mage that name. I mean, that's up to you. Do you live your life, be yourself? But I think it'd be better to go with something that is a bit more connected to the game, like Shadow Spear or something like that. It's your call, though. Do what you got to do, dude. After all, that's what I did back in the Burning Crusade. Esfant is asking a question. Uh, does the Star Forge logo look like a penis? And dude, like, do you guys see this shit? This is what I have to deal with. I have to read these ridiculous questions like, holy fuck, man. But yeah, I guess if you squint, maybe it kind of looks like a penis. I mean, it's not a big deal or anything. It is what it is, guys. But if anyone asks, it's a Warforge logo. True and real. Nolan, if you were a raid boss in World of Warcraft, then what mechanics would you have? Um, what a day, dude. What a uh, fucking day. Yeah, if I was a raid boss in World of Warcraft, that would definitely be something. Well, I'd probably have some kind of mechanic that involves Dr. Pepper. You know it, I know it, everyone knows it. Dr. Pepper is the best. Maybe players have to toss a can of Dr. Pepper at me and then I'd do an AoE attack because I'd be so overwhelmed by the joy of drinking the wonderful beverage that I'd lose control. Who knows, maybe they'd have to buy a case of it as part of a quest reward. Negative reward structure, eh? Yeah, intellectually dishonest, but it would be hilarious. Like, oh my God. Let's go big dick, boys. Am I right? And there it is. There it is. Known for a thing. Asmongold, can you explain how babies are made by only using World of Warcraft metaphors? Uh, well, you see, babies are made from a combination of really complicated questing, crafting the best gear, and a bit of chaos. It starts by advancing the main storyline and building a foundation of trust and loyalty. Then you need to complete a few challenging dungeons and brave new raid. Finally, you mix it all together and add a rogue or two, and voila! 
a baby is made. It's just like a wow raid, except much cuter. But ultimately, it takes lots of dedication and skill to make a baby, just like a guild raid, true and real. Gaming Dizar GG says, which WoW character would you totally smash and why? Uh, that's a tough one, dude. I mean, obviously, I'd have to go with my main character from way back, my Hunter Asmon Gold. But I would also totally go for Tyrande Whisperwind for sure. She's definitely got that whole elf vibe going for her, and I'm a sucker for a good elf girl. Plus, she has that amazing eyesight that would come in handy during epic raids. And of course, you can't forget Jaina Proudmore. That girl is fire. She can shoot lightning and control powerful elements. You can't not love her. So yeah, all in all, Asmongold, Tyrande, and Jaina, what a great trio. Now, I just need to set up a WoW dating simulator, and that would make my dreams come true. I guess the only downside is the wrath of my mom. But it is what it is. I'm going to do what I want. Let's go, big dick boys. Asmongold, um, do you eat corn the long way? Dude, why do you even ask? Is that even a real question? Come on, like I need to be asked that. Let's go big dick, boys. Of course I eat corn the long way. I always thought it was the best way. It's like stapling together a ton of kernels of corn into one giant piece. What a day, dude. What a fucking day. True and real. <laughs> SFAN TV is asking, who will win the Super Bowl? Dude, I don't know. Who cares? Uh, it's just football. It's not like we're going to jump off a cliff or rob a bank. It's okay to not care and just to stay at home and play video games. That's why I play WoW. Like, holy fuck, man. What a day, dude. What a fucking day. It's a, let's go, big dick boys. Esfand, who will be the next person to join OTK? Uh, true and real. You never know who might hop on the OTK train next. It could be the craziest dude you never know, or it could be a boring Sam's Club dude with Argyle socks. Not going to talk about it for an hour, but I will say this. Let's go big dick, boys. Uh, and hopefully they come with big booba streamers because you know it, I know it, everybody knows it. Great games always come with cats with big furry ears. It is what it is, dudes. Prime Gaming asks, what kind of hardware is this running on? What kind of hardware is this running on? Dude, it's running on some high-grade, big-dick, energy-fueled gaming tech. I'm talking top-of-the-line GPU, CPU, and more. No expense spared. Yeah, it's true and real. I mean, did you expect anything less? Water? Oh, why would I drink water when I can drink Dr. Pepper? Go oh, big dick, boys. <laughs> I feel like how he randomly plugs Dr. Pepper and go big dick all the time. Shamo Lamo says, ask Asmon Gold, like Asmon Gold, what did you have for breakfast today? Uh, oh, geez, uh, the usual, uh, you know what I mean? Cold pizza and some Dr. Pepper, of course. It, it's the same thing every day, so why change? I can't even remember the last time I had something different for breakfast, probably around the same time I last showered. But you know, water. Why would I drink water when I can have Dr. Pepper? Most delicious thing out there. Plus, it's got so much flavor and caffeine. What more do you need from a breakfast drink? Can you give some tips on how to get your crush to like you back? Uh, ah, that's a tough one. My advice would be don't play video games with them. It's a slippery slope. Ball. Plus, if you're playing WoW and they're losing all the time, you're going to have an uphill battle on your hands. Plus, dudes, don't come at your crush with the big dick energy. Too many people do that. You got to show some subtly and finesse and maybe get them something nice, like a Dr. Pepper eye. I've had some success with it. But trust me, it doesn't always work. It is what it is, dudes. It is what it is. You got to give a Dr. Pepper, man. What the fuck, man? Dr. Pepper must be eating popcorn with all the free advertisement. Like Knut asks, how do you think Esfand would manage downhill skiing? Uh, ah, man, Esfand would probably break a lot of skis. Dude can't stay away from drama, and I guarantee he will be getting in trouble. He barely knows how to stay upright on flat ground, so that's going to be a disaster when he goes downhill. What a day, dude. We got to go down and save him if he makes it to the bottom. He's going to need a lot of help if he wants to ski down a mountain, I'm telling you. 
We got Papa Juice here saying, what would Asmongol do if he was in charge of Blizzard? If I was in charge of Blizzard, I'd introduce a negative reward structure to encourage players to engage more in the game's lore and content. I'd also get rid of all the pay-to-win garbage that's slowly ruining the game. I'd bring back all the old-school Blizzard games, reintroduce the brutal gladiator gear, and force everyone to play with a crystal-forged war axe at least once a week. Plus, I'd do some serious nerfs to the e-girls who need to stop streaming with their big boobs and get back to playing the game. Oh, what a day, dude. What a fucking day. Let's go big dick, boys. Am I right? True and real. Oh, my God, man. Starforge PCs? Dude, why would I spend ridiculous amounts of money on a gaming computer when I can spend the same money on Dr. Pepper? Like, I'm just not into that whole expensive gaming gear thing. But honestly, if you like it and have the means, more power to you, why not? It's what you like, and I get it. I just don't care for it myself. It is what it is, y'all. Don't let anyone drag you down or call you a nerd because of it. Let's go big dick, boys. Pro Grouder, if you replace all planks on a ship piece by piece, is it no longer the same ship after all pieces are replaced? True and real. It is what it is, boys. I'm not going to talk about it for an hour. It's like that old saying, dude, a ship is only a ship because of the planks it comprises. But you know it, I know it, everyone knows it, nothing lasts forever. Even if you replace all the planks on a ship piece by piece, it's still technically the same ship. It just isn't the same version of the ship as before. That's real crazy. What a cock in the ass. Let's go big dick boys. <laughs> this is so funny. This is so fucking funny, man. Moral, if you could meet anyone in the world, who would you want to meet? Who would I want to meet? Oh, man, that's a tough one. Um, I mean, let me think. There's so many people out there I'd love to meet. On one hand, I would love to meet someone who has a deep knowledge and understanding of video games. And in that case, Elon Musk would be top of my list. He's got so much technological expertise and can marry it to gaming and understand it better than anyone. Or I guess if I'm dreaming, I'd love to meet someone like Bill Gates because of the obvious reasons, you know, money but also because he's one of the richest people in the world, and that's got to come with a lot of wisdom. Need to soak that up. But if I'm really going to be honest, I think I just want to meet someone like me, someone who is a chill gamer dude and who understands the struggles and the triumphs of streaming. Dude, that would be a dream come true. Let's do it. Man, this is really good. Another question here from Strife From Me says, I heard Dr. Pepper can cause small dick energy. Is that true? No way, dude. I drink Dr. Pepper all the time and my dick is perfectly fine. In fact, I'm super confident in it. I mean, let's be real. There it is, boys. It is what it is. That said, I'm still a big believer in living and letting live. Dr. Pepper is great. And if someone else doesn't want to drink it, that's on them. Plus, there's nothing like that sweet taste of Dr. Pepper after a hard day of grinding. Let me tell you. Okay, Esfant is asking a question here. Is Weishtola your favorite waifu? Bro, like, are you really saying this? You... Do you guys see this? And this is what I have to deal with. I have to read this stuff. Like, holy fuck, man. I, uh, sure, Yishtola is a boss lady, but everyone knows that big boob cat girls are much hotter. Yeah, you know it. I know it. Everyone knows it. I also think that any girl is always hotter when you add cat ears. Honestly, I don't think I can even pick a favorite waifu at this point. It's a tough choice. Although I will say those cat girls better watch out for the one and only Big Dick Energy himself. Yeah, there it is, boys. There it is. What a day, dude. What a F asterisk 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 I ang day. One sec. 